Hello dear students, in the previous video we have discussed the problems on lines of regression and correlation coefficient. Next, show that if theta is the angle between the lines of regression, then tan theta is equal to sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square into 1 minus r square by r. Solution, we know that if theta is acute, the angle between the lines y is equal to m1x plus c1 and y is equal to m2x plus c2 is given by tan theta is equal to m2 minus m1 divided by 1 plus m1 into m2. We have the lines of regression y minus y bar is equal to r into sigma y divided by sigma x into x minus x bar. Take this equation 1. And x minus x bar is equal to r into sigma, sigma x divided by sigma y into y minus y bar. We can rewrite the second equation as y minus y bar right as it is y minus y bar and cross multiply here r into sigma y goes to the goes to the numerator therefore this goes to the this value r into sigma uh, sigma y goes to the numerator sigma y here r into sigma x goes to the denominator into x minus x bar just uh, cross multiply we take this equation as 2 next compare this equation with the equation of the line y is equal to M, mx plus c here this is y and this is m this is x plus c c here c is the constant the here c is 0 and this is also in second equation also this is in the form of y is equal to y is equal to m into this is x y is equal to m into x plus c here c is equal to 0 and here the slope of equation 1 and 2 are respectively are respectively given by here what is m here y is equal to m x m is here we take uh, this as m1 m1 is equal to r into sigma x sigma y divided by sigma x and uh, here y is equal to m into x this is a we take uh, this as m2 m2 is equal to sigma y divided by r into sigma x and uh, substituting these values in equation uh, in uh, in equation tan theta is equal to m2 minus m1 divided by 1 plus m1 into m2 tan theta is equal to m2 minus m1 what is m2 m2 is uh, m2 sigma y by r into sigma x minus m1 is r into sigma y by sigma x by here 1 plus m1 into m2 therefore 1 plus what is m1 m1 is r into sigma y by sigma y by sigma x and m2 is sigma y by r into sigma x here in the numerator take uh, sigma y by sigma x as the common factor the remaining term is 1 by r minus r divided by here 1 plus here r r get cancelled r r get cancelled sigma y into sigma y is a sigma y whole square sigma x into sigma x is a sigma x whole square that is equal to here write this term as it is sigma y divided by sigma x here take a r lcm therefore here 1 minus r into r is r square the whole divided by r here divided by here a sigma x whole square is the common so LCM. Sigma x whole square into 1 is a sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square divided by sigma x whole square. Here one term of uh, sigma x get cancelled. One term of sigma x get cancelled. Here this is the numerator, this is the denominator. The denominator of denominator goes to the numerator. Therefore sigma x goes to the numerator. Therefore sigma x into sigma y. Sigma x into sigma y. This term already cancelled. Sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square. Therefore, that is sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square. Write 1 minus r square divided by r as it is. 1 minus r square divided by r. This is the angle between the angle between the two angle between the two regression lines. Note if r is equal to plus or minus 1, tan theta is equal to here take r is equal to plus 1. Here 1, one square is 1. Therefore 1 minus 1 is 0. 0 into anything is 0. Therefore tan theta is equal to 0. Tan theta is equal to 0. Here theta is equal to tan inverse of 0. Tan inverse of 0 is 0. Therefore theta is equal to 0. Which implies that two regression lines coincide. Theta is equal to 0 means what? Two regression lines coincide. Therefore two regression lines are coincide means Variables are perfectly correlated. Variables are perfectly correlated. If r is equal to zero, r is equal to zero, r is equal to zero. Anything divided by zero is infinity. 
infinity into infinity is infinity into anything is a, again infinity therefore tan theta is equal to tan theta is equal to infinity or r here theta is here tan theta is equal to infinity can be written as tan pi by 2 tan tan get cancelled theta is equal to pi by 2 here r is equal to 0 theta is equal to pi by 2 if theta is equal to pi by 2 means what the lines are perpendicular and hence the variables are uncorrelated if lines are per perpendicular the variables are uncorrelated here the, hence we conclude that r is equal to plus or minus 1 the variables are perfectly correlated if r is equal to 0 the variables are uncorrelated next problems if the coefficient of correlation between the two variables x and y is 0 0.5 and the acute angle between their lines of regression is tan inverse of 3 by 5 so that sigma y is equal to 2 into sigma x or sigma x is equal to 2 into sigma y by data the correlation of the coefficient of correlation is 0 0.5 r is equal to 0.5 and theta is equal to angle acute angle between the between their lines of regression theta is equal to tan inverse of 3 by 5 and uh, take tan on both side tan theta is equal to tan inverse tan of tan inverse of 3 by 5 is uh, 3 by 5 the acute angle between the lines of regression is given by tan theta is equal to sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square into 1 minus r square divided by r here uh, tan theta is equal to 3 by 5 that is equal to sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square 1 minus r, r is 0 0.5 0 0.5 can be written as 1 by 2 whole square divided by here r is 1 by 2. Simplifying this, theta is equal to 3 by 5, it is equal to sigma x into sigma y divided by sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square. Here simplify this, 1 minus 1 by 2 whole square can be written as 1 by 4. 4 is the LCM, 4 is the LCM, 4, 4 is the LCM, 4 1 is the 4. 4 minus 1 is 3, therefore 3 by 4, 3 by 4, divided by here 1 by 2. This is the denominator. Denominator of denominator goes to the numerator. 2 goes to the numerator. Therefore, 2 divided by 1. Or 1 by here 3, 3 get cancelled. 3, 3 get cancelled. Here 1, 1 by 5. 1 by 5 that is equal to here sigma x into sigma y. Here 2 1s are 2 2 are. Therefore, 2 into sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square. And uh, first multiply with the 2, 2 into sigma x whole square, 2 into sigma y whole square and cross multiply. Therefore, 2 into sigma x whole square, 2 into sigma y whole square, that is equal to cross multiplication, 5 into sigma x into sigma y, 4 r, 2 into sigma x whole square and uh, shifting this term, it will become minus, minus 5 into sigma x into sigma y, write this term as it is, plus 2 into sigma y whole square, that is equal to 0. Factorization. Here uh, factorization, what are the factors? First we need to find out the factors. Here 2 into 2. If you multiply, we get uh, 4 into sigma x whole square, sigma y whole square. And if we add, we get uh, minus y into sigma x into sigma y. What is the possibility? What are the factors? Minus 4 into minus 4 and uh, minus 1. Minus 4, minus 4, minus 1 is minus 5. If you multiply minus 4 into minus 1 is uh, plus 4. That is the possibility. Therefore, this can be written as 2 into sigma x whole square minus 4 into 5, sigma x into sigma y can be written as a minus 4 into sigma x into sigma y minus sigma x into sigma y plus that. This can be written as this right as it is plus 2 into sigma y whole square that is equal to 0. After taking the common factor, we get 2 into sigma x minus sigma y into sigma x minus 2 into sigma y that is equal to 0. Therefore, 2 into sigma x minus sigma y is equal to 0. Therefore, uh, 2 into sigma or sigma y is equal to 2 into sigma x. And here sigma x minus 2 into sigma y is equal to 0. Therefore, uh, sigma x is equal to 2 into sigma y. That is the proof. Next. Next problem. In a bivariate distribution, sigma x is equal to sigma y. And the angle between the regression lines is a tan inverse of 3. Find the correlation coefficient. Solution. If theta be the theta be the angle between the lines of regression, we have tan theta is equal to sigma x into sigma y divided by 
sigma x whole square plus sigma y whole square into 1 minus r square by r. Take this equation 1. By data, what is the angle between the regression line? It for theta is equal to tan inverse of 3. Or take the tan on both sides, tan theta is equal to tan of tan inverse of 3 is 3. And given data is sigma x is equal to sigma y. Therefore, equation 1 becomes tan theta is equal to 3, 3 is equal to here sigma y is equal to sigma x. If sigma y is equal to sigma x, sigma x into sigma x is sigma x whole square. You do by here also sigma y is equal to sigma x. Sigma y whole square is a sigma x whole square. Sigma x whole square plus sigma x whole square is a 2 into sigma x whole square. Write this term as it is. And here sigma x whole square, sigma x whole square get cancelled. Here only 2 into r. Cross multiply 2 into r. 2 into r into 3 is a 6r is equal to 1 minus r square. And shifting uh, these two terms, minus r square will become plus r square. Plus 1 become minus 1. Write a 6 into r as it is. That is equal to 0. Next, we need to find out the root of this equation with the quadratic equation by using the formula r is equal to minus b plus r minus square root of b square minus 4 ac divided by 2a. And uh, this is in the form of ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. Therefore, a is equal to 1, b is equal to 6, c is equal to minus 1. Therefore, r is equal to minus b, b is 6, therefore minus 6 plus r minus square root of b square minus 4 ac b square b is a 6 square is a 36 minus 4 into a is 1 c is minus 1 minus 4 minus 1 is a plus 4 36 plus 4 is a 40 root 40 divided by 2 into a a is 1 that is equal to minus 6 plus or minus root 40 can be written as a 4 into 10 root 4 is a 2 right outside only root of 10 divided by 2 if you take the 2 2 as a common factor here 2 into minus 3 plus or minus 2 as a common term, common factor only root 10 divided by 2. This 2 and common, common factor 2, common term 2 get cancelled, only we get minus 3 plus or minus root 10. Therefore, r is equal to, here we have the two values, one, one is minus 3 plus root 10, the other value is minus 3 minus root 10. Therefore, minus 3 plus root 10 is a plus 0 0.1623. If you take a minus 3, minus root 10 is minus 6.1623. And we know that the values of uh, the values of r lies between minus 1 and uh, plus 1. Therefore, take uh, this value. r is equal to 0 0.1623. That is the coefficient of correlation. Or if you take the modulus, if you take the, the magnitude of uh, this value, therefore, the magnitude of this value lies less or, less or equal to 1. The magnitude of r, this value, less or less or equal to 1. Therefore, this value lies between minus 1 and minus 1 and plus 1. We take this value. Do, don't take this value because, because this value does not lies between minus 1 and plus 1. Neglect this value. Therefore, r is equal to 0 0.1623. Thank you.